There's no such thing as work-life balance. No! And life is not a fucking journey. It's only if you're a meathead, clubfoot, retard. And for those of you, I'm not trying to, if some of you are, have uh, issues with retardation, I'm not trying to, uh, that's not what I'm talking about. That's not what I'm talking about. It's a model. You find someone, as I said yesterday after, where, where he or she is where you want to be. And then you model them. You mimic them. You copy them. Same way you would if you want to be a footballer. Same way you want to be if you want to be um, uh, a golfer. You don't copy some monkey uh, that can't break 100, do you? Socrates, played on Aristotle, had this figured out two, 3,000 years ago. What the fuck happened? Why did we stop? These are arguably the first mentor-mentee relationships that existed on the planet. I'm not teaching anything new, guys, gals. I give credit to the man that I copied, Andrew Carnegie came up with the QLA model and didn't call it QLA because he, was a, he, was, he could have been Dutch, really. He was a meat, mean, cheap person that didn't want to spend money, so he didn't allow equity in his transactions. He only used debt, as you would say, debt. So he would still own it all, and that's all I did. He was doing this 140 years ago, what I do. Why don't investment bankers, why does an ING bank teach you how to do this? Because there's no fees for them to collect. That's why. Now, everything has got derivatives. It's got this, it's got that, and everything is associated with a fee and another fee and a fee and a fee. That's why the world isn't being taught this, because there's no money in it. Now, the next part of the equation is why isn't anybody teaching it anyway, like me? Because nobody's done it. They've grown up in the new investment bank world. I didn't create $50 billion by accident. 